is first of four two crimes in two towns linked together. Now police are on the hunt for a suspect. Thanks for joining us this hour. I'm Ben Goldman. It all started with a tragic incident last night in Norwich. A one month old baby killed after being attacked by a family's dog. As police continue to investigate that deadly attack, police are also looking into a house fire that happened this morning in New London, which is now believed to somehow be connected to this separate incident in Norwich. According to police, the father of the baby killed in that dog attack is suspected of arson in an early morning fire in New London. A lot of new developments in this story. Fox 61's Tony Terzi joining us live from Norwich Police Department to break all of this down for us. It could be confusing, right, Tony? Hey, Ben, good afternoon, everyone. Yeah, Norwich police held a press conference at about 2 o'clock today in between Norwich and New London police. They say they believe that there is a connection between the dog attack last night, which ultimately, they say, triggered the fire on Rosemary Street in New London. The investigation for now is active, and that includes searching for a person of interest. Just after 8.30 Monday night, Norwich police called to this three-story apartment house on McKinley Avenue as a result of a reported dog attack. Upon arrival, officers discovered uh, that a one-month-old infant boy was attacked by the family's dog. Uh, the family's dog was a mixed-breed male pit bull mix. The one month old Carter Settles succumbed to injuries he sustained while a family member was holding him when the dog jumped up and started biting. The dog is presently quarantined for the state mandated 14 days by animal control before its fate is to be determined. There were two adult family members at the residence at the time, the child's mother and the child's paternal grandmother. And the child's father, who does not live in the Norwich apartment, is now wanted for questioning by police, but not in connection with the child's death. Instead, about an early morning fire in New London. He's a 32-year-old African-American male. He is approximately six, six, six foot four, 240 pounds, and he's got some type of scar on his face. His forehead. Investigators say the front porch of this Rosemary Street home was intentionally set on fire at about 4 a.m. And sources close to the investigation say someone living in this house may be a relative of Timothy Settles. We don't have probable cause for an arrest yet, but we do. We want his name out there so people know if they know who he is and he can have him turn himself in so we can question related to fire. Uh, New London police uh, say that Timothy Settles may be driving a white BMW with uh, New York plates. Now, also, Norwich police say that they ar arrested Timothy Settles back in August. According to court records, Settles pleaded guilty to charges of third degree assault and also interfering with an officer and resisting arrest. Again, Timothy Settles, a man who is wanted by New London police. We're live here in Norwich, Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.